Hi there, this is Ron here from Clustered Networks and today what I'm going to do is show you how to check your server for the new Java Apache Log4j vulnerability. Now of course if you haven't heard about this uh, you're probably not in the loop but uh, there's lots of exploits out there for the critical code execution vulnerability and everybody wants to be able to check their servers to see if they're patched and to be able to patch them up if necessary. So this sh uh, video isn't going to show you how to patch them up, but it is going to be able to show you how to check your server to see whether it's vulnerable. Now, uh, I'm going to have a blog article that I'm going to be adding to here, but uh, basically there's a, a script on GitHub that you can go to that shows you uh, a checker for beta. And uh, I'm always leery about checking some of these... Uh, scripts that you run on your server. So I wanted to look into it. So I open the script up and here I can see all it is doing is using the locate command and then grepping for the log4js files. And if you have them, then you're vulnerable. If you don't have them, then you're not using a, a program um, on your server to be able to, to run that. So this uses uh, both the, the um, Debian package manager as well it checks on the um, yum which is the yellow yellow dog updater modified so as you can see the script just greps and it checks uh, yum to see whether you have yum installed or whether you have uh, the Debian package manager in my case I have the Debian so now I'm going to open up a window here on a server so I'm locate uh, logged in here to a server uh, server 20 which is a local server that I have here in my office and I'm just gonna grab this script from the site so simple copy go back to my terminal paste it in so basically it's saying go get that script and run it and when I run it it shows that maybe those files were vulnerable, but I don't really have any of those files on there, so I don't have to worry. It says Java is not installed. So I don't have to worry about it. So as you can see, it's all looking good for me, and that's how I can do a quick check. So I hope you like this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel. And also I'll have a link to these scripts that are mentioned in this video. Thanks again for watching.